indeed the management parents graduates and students of marist companies of academy uturu abia state are grateful to god for his manifold blessings Reverend Father Ben Ike encouraged all present at the celebration mass to count their blessings always. Most times we spend much time counting our woes and our disappointments to the extent that uh, we hardly recognize or appreciate the goodness of God in our lives. So this Sunday the church reminds us of the importance of showing gratitude to God. And if we just spend a moment to reflect on the course of our life, we shall definitely find many reasons why we must always return to God with our heart full of gratitude. Members of class of 2022 are happy and deeply grateful to God because it is their graduation day. They took the Bible readings. A reading from Second Corinthians. In those days, Lema and the Syrian went down and dipped themselves several times in the Jordan. Responsorial sound. One of them who passed on was fondly remembered. We're supposed to be among these graduating students today in the person of Ebo Bernard. So I would like us to stand now and observe a mini silent in his honor and for his happy repose. May the soul of Ebo Bernard and the souls of the faithful departed. May he rest in peace. Marist Comprehensive Academy is a 41-year-old co-educational secondary school owned and run by the Marist Brothers of the Schools, province of Nigeria. These boys and girls have been prepared for life outside secondary school. They can respect, they can pray, they can study, they know when, when to get up in the morning and when to sleep. They have regretted so far so much that they know what to do. So I think Competitive, you are sending the best in the, to the world. Class of 2022 came into MCA on the 3rd of September 2016. They paid glowing tribute to their principal, Reverend Brother Joachim Okoye Zetulugu, who spent six years with them. Throughout our stay with him, he never gave up on us. We failed a lot of tests, but he didn't do well because of them. He continued carrying us along. We know him to be a very mother's brother. They also celebrated their teachers. So our very best teachers, we learn from you a lot. But we pray to you every time. You stress yourself just to make sure we receive the best of God. May God bless your time and effort on us. We will not disappoint you. They speak about the values they got from MCA. Hard work, discipline and the fear of God. I can't imagine someone would go through Marriage Compressive Academy or any marriage school at all and not have these three values hard work, discipline, and the fear of God. The values I take from me are actually uncountable, like since my just one, just three, I can't count, but the main ones for me are prayer life, discipline, and self control. MCA taught me how to be who you are, to learn to serve others, to be selfless. MCA taught me to be honest and MCA taught me to be the best I can be. Being respectful, to be honest, and also to spread love wherever you go. If not for this school, I would have learned how to be time conscious. They have taught me to be prayerful. Like, in whatever you do, you should put God first. And yeah, that, that will carry you far in life. And they have taught me to be punctual. Each received a parting gift from the school. Awards were given in different categories. 
The National President of the Old Students Association of Marist Comprehensive Academy, Mr. Okandreme Okandu, inducted them into a Sanka. Repeat after me. I am solemnly pledged and broken allegiance to my alma mater, Marist Comprehensive Academy. Dr. Theodore Iwagu Best Teacher of the Year Academic Cash Award was won by five teachers. Plugs were donated by class of 1992. Marist Comprehensive Academies for both day and boarding students. All students are meant to adhere strictly to all the rules. It's been tough actually, but at the end, we still got here. And I like to say, thank God and thank everyone that was involved. I just, I just love everybody for this. Thank you very much. I'm just very happy that finally the short three years I've spent in MCA have been proven to be worthwhile and I'm finally rounding up here. I feel very happy and excited that my six years of secondary school is finally over and I'm moving on to the next level of education. I feel excited that it's finally over and we're having that official ceremony to round everything up. Parents are also super excited. Bringing a child here, leaving him all the way from Portacot and uh, watching him grow, grow, grow with uh, all the progresses he made and all that, that's the first value. Then um, moral conduct, you know, and other things. It's just like um, an encompass of everything good. I mean, the institution. So I cannot begin to name one, but I'm grateful to God. Yes, I have value. I have value for the decision of bringing him here. And I thank God for that. I would encourage every parent to have a taste of Marist education. These leaders of tomorrow are poised for a better Nigeria. I would like to study medicine because I have that passion and I love to read a lot and I have that passion to care for people around me. I like to be a software engineer because since I was little I, I just love being around the computer. My mom trained me like that. She used to give me a laptop type sometimes. I want to study software engineering. I want to serve my society by helping to eradicate some of the cyber crimes that are going on around. I would like to be a lawyer. As a lawyer, I would like to defend the rights of those who have nobody to defend them. As a lawyer, the highest I can do, the much I can do would be to always stand for the truth and always stand for justice. I love calculation and I feel like I'm very accountable. Also, people around me have told me how accountable I can be. Someone can entrust me with 50,000 and just leave me and you come back to me for it. That was, that was a really nice thing for them to do and they really encouraged me to go for this accountancy. Marist Comprehensive Academy's class of 2022 has put her trust in God for a glorious future.